Hey yo, what's up guys? Pase Baller here. We are now on this NFL game that we will be talking about. This is uh, Miami Dolphins uh, with the record of 8-7 and seven, uh, going up against Tennessee Titans with a record of 10-5. and five. Um, Again, before we proceed, I'm just inviting everyone who have not subscribed yet to our uh, YouTube account or YouTube channel, Pase Baller. Please click on the subscribe button below. At the same time, hit on the bell logo. That way, automatically, you guys will be receiving notifications whenever new videos are uploaded we actually do nba nfl and philippine basketball predictions down there and we're just waiting for mlb to kick in and we will be including that too all right miami dolphins we all know what's going on with miami dolphins we talk about streak they are the hottest team right now i gotta say um and of course they, they need this win too uh you know to keep their playoff uh playoffs picture or playoffs chances alive um and for tennessee titans uh they're still you know they're still okay with that record of 10 and 5 but of course they would want to get this win so that they can secure the top spot by the way the spread is a uh, minus 3.5 for tennessee titans um my take in here is that uh number one um, the mom- talk about momentum. Uh, if you if you'd lo- if you'd actually uh, look at uh, Miami Dolphins' game, um, it's totally different, way different from how they were like uh, in the, the very beginning of the season. Very different too if you're gonna watch the Titans games um, because uh, the Dolphins uh, they got this momentum and they got this confidence towards their uh, quarterback Tua, um, and they you know they put their trust in him, man. Um, unlike uh, the Titans, uh, it's it's like the moment that they lost Henry. It's not like they they knew that you know they, they are losing, but it's just totally different, man. Um, it's not the Titans that I you know that I know that are that I'm used to. Uh, ever since they lost Henry, whenever I watch their games, man, I I don't last for like half an hour because they're totally different. Just I can't you know I can't put it in words. Um, Another another thing is that uh, uh, the Titans they just don't know what the approach would be like. Um, that, that is at least for me, right? Um, they just don't know what the approach would be like if 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 they would run a play. Um, number one, uh, their quarterback keeps on getting sacked. Number two, again, um, it's like you are confused whether they want to run or they want to you know they want to have it passed. You just don't you know you just don't know. They lost their identity. The moment they lost Henry, um, for Miami Dolphins, man, uh, again, it's totally different, man. They, you know, they knew what they had to do, and that is to, you know, to listen to their quarterback. And I gotta give a props or um, kudos to uh, Coach Flores for actually um, making it happen. I'm not saying that without Flores, um, Tua wouldn't be that good, but Tua is good. But uh, with with Flores in, um, they were able to figure out. What were the needed plays for Tua to be more effective and Tua to be like who he is right now? Seven game winning streak. I'm looking at this one. Of course, I'm picking Miami Dolphins with a plus 3.5 in here. But guys, don't be you know <laughs> don't be surprised if Miami Dolphins would actually win this one outright and keep your playoffs alive. My pick: Miami Dolphins plus 3.5. Peace out, passe love, and God bless.